There are three probing features Doosan machinists use every day, bore, web, and corner. After this video, you'll be able to measure basic shapes and use the features as fixture offsets. Cool, huh? So here we go. Basic probing techniques using Rangui. Let's do this. Welcome to Know Your Doosan. First things first, let's make sure our calibrated probe is loaded in the spindle with the proper height offset active. Let's start out on the control by pressing the GUI hard key. Now let's press the probe soft key. You will notice that we have a variety of choices. We're going to start with bore. I want you to select bore and fill out the work offset box. In my case, it's G54. Next, let's press input and fill out the diameter box and press input again to follow the GUI message. Now I'll put the machine in hand wheel to position the probe in the center of the bore as the instructions told me to. Last, I'll press the memory hard key and finally press the cycle start button. Great work. Let's move on to web. I want you to press probe, then web, and now we can complete the steps. Our web type for this application is Y. My work offset is G54. The estimated width of my part is 2.9 inches. My depth is half an inch. Here I'm gonna get a message to position the probe above the web center. Let's put the machine in handle mode and move the probe into place. Press the memory hard key and then press the cycle start button and the machine will start measuring. Note that the work offset will change automatically and the screen will note the size of the bore and what the difference was between what I entered and what the machine actually measured. Two down, one to go. Let's cover the corner feature. Here again, we're gonna press probe, then corner, then complete the following steps. This one's pretty simple. It's my corner type. Here we need to tell the machine if it's an internal or external corner. Second, my corner number. Let's tell the machine which corner we will be using, toggling it with the select soft key. In my case, it's corner number three. My work offset is G54. My distance for D is one inch. My distance for E is one inch. After the boxes are filled out, we'll get a message to position the probe 400 thousandths of an inch from the corner. Let's put the machine in handle mode and move the probe into place. Last, we'll press the memory hard key and then the cycle start button and the machine will start measuring. You're gonna notice again that the work offset will automatically change and the screen will note the X and Y positions that were probed. There we have it. We just completed three common GUI measuring cycles with our probe and the GUI software. I want you to return to this video when you need to use the Renishaw measuring cycles inside your Doosan machine to set your work offsets and measure common features. I hope this video was helpful to you. If you'd like to see me cover a specific topic in a future Know Your Doosan video, just post your suggestions in the comments below. 